People do play with people. They play with people. They waste their time. And it's just like, do you want to be with me or not? Welcome back, YouTube fam. So we are back with yet another new show. <laughs> it is called Put a Ring on It. Put a ring on it. Yes. Like Beyonce said, put a ring on it. <laughs> um, so yeah, now this is the first season of this one um, coming on on. So it's exciting. Um, I think Will Packer produced this one again, right? I think so. I think so, yeah. Again, I'm Blythe. And I'm um, Brandon. <laughs> if you haven't done so already, okay? You guys already know what time it is. Smash that subscribe button <laughs> and hit the bell so you get post notifications so you know whenever we drop new content okay give us a like that way youtube will push our content out to more people and the more people that watch our show the more conversations we can have okay so hop in the comments let us know if you're watching this show i know we're all starting fresh with this one because this is a new show right. all right so hop in the comments and let us know what you thought about these couples there's a lot to, to unpack here so, so definitely hop in the comments i'm interested to see <laughs> what you guys uh, think about this episode all right, other than that, we're gonna go ahead and get into it. All right, so this show is starting out, um, once again, we're set in Atlanta. Oh. And um, all we're starting out with three couples. And they all come to um, a mansion where they are meeting with Dr. Nicole. She's the relationship um, doctor. Now, I will say it looks like we are gonna have another couple come on later on, but they didn't come in on this episode, okay? So this is episode one. Um, so, with um, Dr. Nicole, she seems pretty good. I feel like she's a pretty good uh, relationship uh, expert therapist. I feel like she's pretty good just so far. Um, so, we got three couples here, and man, what is it? The show is set for seven weeks, and they're going to go through a series of uh, tests and things. Uh, so, let's see. <laughs> the first episode is called Ladies First, and uh, so the first test here was the ladies going out on a date with another man. So, so the, the, the premise <laughs> of the show is that all three of these couples are engaged. No, they're not. Maybe not. They're dating. Right. That's but, the problem. Right. They are not engaged or married, right? That's right. So they want to get a ring on it. They want to, <laughs> I, I don't know, I guess one person kind of more wants to get a ring and the other person doesn't. So we're trying to figure out, you can get to the bottom of why, Each person. you know, why are they still together? Why are they not moving to that next level? And do they need to move to the next level or do they need to, you know, cut ties and move on to something that might be better for them? She says at the end of seven weeks, they're gonna know. Yeah, so, you know, it, it's kind of, you know, you see this a lot in relationships where, uh, you know, couples will be together for like a really long time. And it's like, okay, so are we going to make this official? Or are you just stringing me along and wasting my time type huh. situation? Right. So that's kind of what this show is centered around. And I think it's a really good idea. I think it's going to be really good. Agree. <laughs> <laughs> Hollywood and Ashley. Hmm. So they're, I think they're a cute couple. I really do. I think they're cute. Um, they've been dating for nine years. Yeah. Okay. I'm not going to lie. That's a minute for dating. I'm not gonna, I'm gonna be honest. That is a minute for dating. I mean, to each his own, I'm not judging, but for me, that's, that's a while to be dating. I see why they're on the show. Yeah. Like nine yeah. years of your life, like that's a long time. It is, it is. And they're in what, is. their 30s? Yeah. That's a long yeah. time. So, I mean, you know, <laughs> nine years, look, I need to either, yeah, either we're gonna, Go to the next stage and make this thing official, or like you kind of need to know. <laughs> so let's give the twist. Um, Hollywood says he wants Mary, says he's ready. Ashley said that she she's not sure she's ready. She's not sure she's want to be vulnerable and things like that. They threw me. I was not expecting that. Were you? <laughs> I definitely. It, when you first see him, I mean, right. you definitely think the other way around. You right. definitely think that, yeah. you know, yeah. she's trying to get him mm -hmm. to commit to her, and but he kind of <laughs> wants to, you know, uh, have 
his freedom and things like that. Doesn't seem to be the case, but, but I reserve judgment. But, but, I reserve judgment yeah. um, on that right now. But so what happened apparently is Hollywood um, yeah. proposed to her a while back. And I guess right before he kind of got cold feet and was like, wait, no, I don't know. I don't know if this is what I want to do. <laughs> and then he was like, this is what yeah. I want to do. And he was like, I don't think that. She said and like when they started planning it, right? He started yeah. her back and forth. They started to get cold feet. So um, I guess that just kind of made her like super uncertain. And she was just like, all right, fine. We're not going to do it. Right. And then I guess he came back at a later time and was like, all right. I'm ready. I know what I want to do. Let's get engaged. And she was like, well, but now I'm not ready. So that's an interesting dynamic. Um, yeah, for real. It, I, I'm curious from a woman's point of view, like how would you feel in that situation? Like, if, if, you know, a guy proposes to you, says he's ready to go. He gets cold yeah. feet, pulls out. You guys hold off for a couple years. Now he's coming back and saying, all right, cool. I'm ready. Right. Do you go forward and get married, or are you feeling like she's feeling? I mean, <laughs> me personally, you know how I am. Um, if I'm putting money down on stuff, like, you know, I don't play, okay? Like, do not play with me. <sighs> me personally, we would not be dating right now. I'm gonna I'm gonna cut you off and you're either being like, oh nope, we're gonna get married, or we dating other people. We just we not dating. We just we not still dating. No. But he said he wants to be married though. No, but when I put the money down in the day and stuff, you ain't wanna move forward. Okay. You're right, he does say that, but what about your actions? Honey, actions speak louder than words. That's can talk all day. That's what I was getting. Like, that's kind of what in the back of my mind on face. All we know on face value, the first episode is what they're saying. But for me, I'm just like, it's got to be more. It's got to be more to than, you know, he said he wanted to get married. He got cold feet. Now he does want to get married, but she doesn't want to. Like, it just, I feel like it's got to be more than that. Okay, so talk to us as a man. What's going on with him? I feel like he probably, you know, he's still, you know, but I don't know. Cause I mean, I, I think- I think he loves her. I think I he mean, loves for, her. I do. Yeah, for real, I do. I think he loves her. I think, you know, that's his best friend. Like I that's, absolutely. you know, yeah. but I think he still might be getting some attention from, Oh. you know. So um, you think it's still some wondering going on? I don't know if it's, I don't know if it's necessarily action. Right, I don't know right. the extent. Okay. But there's there's a reason why oh, oh. she okay. does not want to get married. Like, you okay. know what I mean? And so I, you think he could be giving her the reason? Yeah. Okay. So it's not just her, it's something from him. No, I, I think it's something that he's mm. not giving her Okay. at this point. It's not just, I don't believe that it is just what she said it is, that it is just that Oh, you know, when you when we were supposed to do it before, you pulled right. out. So now I'm not. Mm, I feel like it has to be more than that. Okay. Like on face value, like I think for a guy to get cold feet before a marriage, as inconvenient sure. as That's, it is, yeah, yeah, I think that that is somewhat Normal. understandable. Yeah, yeah. So if he really just got cold feet and said, "Wait, I don't, you know, I, don't I just don't know," right. and he came back, okay, you know what? took some time <laughs> you know what i mean i got my mind right like there's nobody for right. me but you i'm ready right. to do it okay. and i and and she really <laughs> felt secure in it and in the relationship and he's shown it he's consistent uh, that's true. i think she would get married okay so i feel like there's something and i think over the course of the show maybe we'll find out but that's mm. my prediction from a man's point of view okay mm. Mm -mm -mm. now that was a mess with this so this episode, the ladies have their dates first. I just thought, now this was a mess, right? No, 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 no. <laughs> like you jump right into it. <laughs> the interesting thing about this show, what? they go on here, they're trying to figure out, you know, whether or not they're oh, gonna get married. Okay. <laughs> they go and date other people. Ooh. Like that's the whole thing about this show. Uh, so we can't just gloss past that. You're right, you're right. That is, right. how do you feel about that? Do you think? that the way to find out whether or not you need to move forward in a relationship with somebody Ooh. is to date 
someone else to see if the grass is greener on the other side. Okay, my answer to your question is no. <laughs> I do not think that's the way you find out if you need to be with somebody by doing that, no. Um, I think this is an interesting concept though. Um, <laughs> it's quite risky though, because you know what I'm saying? Yep. You don't know. Like, what if this does change the game and you connect with someone else and this changes or ends your relationship? Like, this is very risky. But I will say, it could be needed in some situations because people do play with people. They play with people. They waste their time. And it's just like, do you want to be with me or not? So sometimes just in general, you know, people are, you know, hanging people on, not necessarily because they don't want to be with them or love them, but because they're fearful. They, you know, they do kind of have a fear for whatever reason in the background, a fear of getting married. So, it's like I said, I, I'm not saying you should do this, but. Yeah, I, I feel like, um, yeah, I mean, obviously, I, I definitely wouldn't agree under normal circumstances of, you know, all right, let's go date other yeah. people and see if we need to be <laughs> together. But I think within the context of this show, it, it might not be a bad thing. I think sometimes you do need to see, and like I said, you don't want to do it outside of, I think this is kind of like in a controlled environment is what I'll call it. Yeah, you that's know, true too. To kind of see that yeah. the grass is not necessarily greener on the other side. I think a lot of times <laughs> you can't take your partner for granted. So uh, it's an interesting concept and I think it'll, it. Uh, hopefully it helps them. Yeah. Well, um, so <laughs> what I thought was interesting and a little messy is they had, um, Ashley was first up with her date. They had her date come to her house. His name was Ray. He just knocked and showed up at the door. Mm -hmm. No, I don't know. What you think of it? I don't know what they was thinking with that. Like that was just the worst. I was like, I know he's not about to. And he no. and Hollywood's still there, like in the kitchen, just chilling. And another dude is about to come in and take my girl out. Like I was like, yo, they. I hope they got the uh, the the crew on standby, <laughs> Jerry. like and Jerry Springer out this joint, like. Hey, it yeah. might be blows, like, I bro. was like, are they for real? Um, Because it opened up, and they were like, Hollywood is, like, cooking her breakfast and stuff. Like, oh, okay, you getting ready for your day. Cooking her breakfast, talking a little bit of junk. He was he was talking a little junk. And yeah. I was like, aww. Because <laughs> it, now, it's, to me, it show he do love her. I, I really do think he loves her. He likes her. And he was feeling some kind of way. Yeah. What you think? <laughs> Look, hey, he ain't make it easy on dude coming in the door either. He was like, he's sized him up, squared up with him, like, what's up? I don't really, I'm really not feeling this. You taking out my girl. And he tested him to see if he yeah. was going back down and try to make him look like a punk, you know? Yeah, like, that's true. Yeah, you're right. This is a controlled environment because that wouldn't be normal in a normal situation. No, normal situation. We're fighting off on right? site. Like, we, we are fighting. And he, I think he really wanted to, but he was like, the cameras is here. But yeah, nah, he, that, that was, that was, nah, that was foul. Nah, that, you can't do that. Yeah, I was like, y'all a trip. Like, I'm thinking they're going to be in neutral places. You know what I mean? The like, other couple, yeah, the other couple, they made yeah. them in a neutral place. I don't know why they felt the need to have They had to come today towards today. Come in my house, house and you about to take out my girl. I'm like, no. Whew. So... That was uh, interesting, yeah. But uh, how do you, what do you think about Ashley? She was, she was okay. What do you think? I think she's a little nervous though. What on the date? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. I, 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 I feel like she, whatever it is that Hollywood is not giving her, I feel like she is, you know, trying to. I don't know, pull that out of, you know, the date that she that she's having with this guy. Like, mm -hmm. I don't know, there's something that she's missing and she's trying to see if- She really looking. Yeah, like, mm -hmm. I, I, I don't know, I can't explain it and I can't fully describe it, but there's something so missing and she's just trying to like, I don't know if it's wake Hollywood up or if it's just, you know, make him a little uncomfortable, whatever it is. Mm -hmm. Cause again, he's saying that he wants her there's a reason, there's something that day, the that's day. holding her back from yeah. just being, okay, sure, let's go. So. Mm, that's true. 
Well, um, they had a cute little day. They went to the park, like riding bikes or something. Um, then they, you know, sat down and talked a little bit. Um, you know, talking about where they're from and things like that. And I guess like what, what they're looking for and kind of stuff like whatever. It was um, cute. Oh, it wasn't really too deep. I mean, it was, yeah. It was, yeah. Um, so <laughs> she got back home. Hollywood wasn't, uh, he was just, how was it? Uh, I don't know what he was expecting to hear. Um, she did not give him what he wanted to hear. I know that he was. Uh, I don't think there was really anything she could have said that, mm -hmm. you know, would have made him happy. Well, yeah, she could have came and said, it was terrible. I hate him. That's true. I mean, and she's not going to give him that. <laughs> of course not. And that's what I'm saying. Like, there's mm -hmm. some reason, and there's some, some for some reason, she wants him to be a little uncomfortable. Yeah. And we don't know what that is yet, but it's yeah. something. We're going to find out. Um, so, you know, they get back in the end, they all um, conclude to get back to the uh, mansion, um, get back to Dr. Nicole, and um, she asked, you know, how was the dates and everything, and, uh, you know, how did you feel about that person, and uh, actually, she was just like, um, she said it was a good date, she said um, Ray was cool, um, <laughs> she was just saying, um, you know, just one thing, I guess, like, he didn't really give her, like, this attitude, like, you know, this, I guess what? Like, I don't know. Like, I'm the man attitude or something she gets from Hollywood or something. Um, and, you know, she said the conversation with everything good. What about, you remember how Hollywood was acting? He, <laughs> he was not happy about it at uh -uh. all. Like, the whole time, you could tell it was just, you could tell that they've been together for a long time. Yeah, yeah. Like, when you've been with, as a man, when you've been with the same, you know, female for, right. like, an extended period of time, in your eyes, like she is yours. Right. Like right. we're very territorial. Like she is. That's mine. Yeah. So he, he's definitely mad. Yeah. Very uncomfortable with yeah. seeing another man like take out his girl and show her attention yeah. like that. And she was and she had a good time and Yeah. Yeah. And I don't think she had that great of a time. She said she didn't want to go <laughs> on another date just, with him. Yeah. That's true. <laughs> that they weren't asked that if they wanted time. to go on the second date and she said no. Um she no. He, he was still bothered that i guess he was bothered that what she had a good time or she was open i'm telling to you it. it's just like that's he looks at her as like that's mine like i don't okay you going out with another dude is like off no, limits. that's off limits well, but they signed up for the show though so they do but i mean you know sometimes you sign up for stuff you you know it sounds like a good idea and you want to be on tv and stuff like yeah. that but then when the funk hits the fan and yeah. it's really time for another dude to actually literally go out with your girl Reality. those feelings start coming <laughs> up and maybe that's what she wants maybe that's what she wants mm. well so yeah so that concludes them for episode one and uh i think it's gonna get juicy it's gonna get juicy. We're gonna see uh, what's gonna continue to happen with uh, Hollywood and Ashley. All right, so again, if you haven't done so already, guys, smash that subscribe button, hit the bell so you get post notifications so you know whenever we're dropping content, and give us a like. All right, help YouTube, help us, help you, help everybody. <laughs> Just give us a like. Right. All right, matter of fact, I need at least what? Can I get 10 likes on this video? If I get 10 likes on this video, we will continue uh, with the Put A Ring On It series. If not, we're moving on. Oh. All right? <laughs> 10 likes. Yes. Just need 10. <laughs> All right. Hop in the comments. Let us know what you think about these couples. There's a lot to unpack here. Um, let us know what you think. Let, it, let us know if you're seeing some of the same things we're seeing or if you're seeing something different. Um, hop in the comments so we can go back and forth with you and, and, and talk about it. Um, I think that's it. Yeah. Other than that, we will see you guys next time.